Hey there, I'm Meg and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to add Google reviews to your website. Now before we begin, I spent a lot of time putting in research for this tutorial and I am not satisfied with the results. Basically what I was trying to do is figure out how to embed a Google review on your website, just like you can do with Facebook and I have a tutorial for that which I will link to. Now what that means is you would embed basically a little box of each individual review onto your website so that way it would look like like a Google review. It wouldn't just be copying text over. The box would actually look like how the review would appear on Google. So if that doesn't make sense, definitely check out my Facebook review video to see kind of how that works. But I have not been able to find a way to embed Google reviews that I'm satisfied with. There are plenty of widgets out there which look beautiful and they definitely capture the look of Google, but you have to pay for them. And I don't think we should have to pay to embed Google reviews on our website. That's just ridiculous to me. So I literally created login accounts on multiple widgets. I tried to see if there's a free version. There is a free version on one, but then you're limited to how many people can view that widget per month, which it's it's just a mess. And like I said, I'm really frustrated <laughs> because I haven't found a way. I did find a page on Google API, which is a place where developers can create custom code that you can use for your Google business profile if you need. But I still, I wasn't able to get that code to work. I found my Google Place ID and all of that, which I have a tutorial for, but it just wasn't working. So if you stumble upon that page and it doesn't work, it's not just you. I tried it too. If I find a better solution for this, I will absolutely create a tutorial. I am looking for a solution. I want a solution. But in the interim, I have a couple of options and I will show you how. So the first option of getting reviews on your website is just a simple copy paste method. So the easiest way that I found to get to my reviews is just to Google my business and then click on the Google reviews link here. You can also access your reviews on the back end, but this is just super easy. So you would find the review that you wish to copy and then you would literally just highlight the text and then you would click copy and then on your website you would paste it in and then you would add the person's name and maybe even their business if they own a business and you're a business to business type business. So the one advantage to doing this method is that you can obviously pick and choose which reviews you add to your website, but let's say that somebody writes you a beautiful review on Google and then they don't write that same review on Facebook, but somebody else writes you a beautiful review on Facebook and they don't write you a review on Google. This method allows you to pull from all of your different review platforms and make it consistent with your branding, which I actually do like the idea of this. So on your website, instead of seeing a Facebook branded review, a Google branded review, a Yelp branded review, you would just see text reviews with the names of the person who reviewed you and it would all adhere to your own website's branding. So the text that you paste in would take on the look of whatever text you have applied to your website's branding. Um, I know it kind of sounds a little convoluted, but I do like this method. There's, there's nothing wrong with this method. You can you know, tweak how you format your text. You have a lot of options. But if you really want to keep the branded look of how this review appears on Google, you can take a screenshot of the review. Now, I do recommend going to a different place to pull that screenshot. So what we're going to do is click on more and then maps. And we're going to scroll down, down, down until we can see our reviews. And we are going to click on share and we're going to make sure send a link is selected. We're gonna copy the link. Now there is this embed a map option and I just wanna point out that I tested this and if you embed the map, it does not show the review, it literally just shows the map of where your business is located. So don't fall for that trick. You want send a link and then you are going to paste that link in. 
And then from here, you can pull the screenshot. Now, it basically looks the same as how the review looked in the very first window that we saw, but it removes the new icon and it, it removes, you know, just a few other little things and it also gives you a bigger window to pull that screenshot from. So I use a Mac, so I'm going to hold down Command Shift 4 and I'm just going to drag my cursor over the screenshot and I'm just over the review and I'm just going to screenshot this section and reviews are automatically sent to a folder in my Dropbox. So then I would just pop over to my website and I would add a photo and then I would just upload the review. And you can also, if your website allows it, you can create a slideshow so you can have the reviews automatically rotate if you have multiple reviews instead of having the reviews side by side on your website. So again, this is not the ideal solution of how to get Google reviews to your website, but it is a workaround if you do not want to spend money on a widget like me. I will continue monitoring and seeing if there is a better way to embed actual Google reviews on your website. And when I find the solution, I will create a tutorial. So stick around, subscribe to see how long it takes me to figure it out. And I will see you in the next video.